Whether you're a vegetarian or you're just looking to boost the number of vegetables in your diet, today's recipe is perfect as either a side dish or a main meal unto itself. Let's make an easy ratatouille on The One Pot Chef. Ratatouille is basically a cross between a vegetable stew and a warm vegetable salad. It's very simple to prepare and only takes a few minutes to cook all up. So first things first, I've got a little bit of olive oil in a heavy based pan. One that's got a lid because I'll need a lid later. And I'm going to add in some garlic, about two cloves of crushed garlic. I'm just using the stuff out of a jar. I'm also adding in two red capsicums or red bell peppers, depending on where you live. And I've just sliced them up and taken all the seeds out. And we're just going to cook this stirring for a couple of minutes over a medium to high heat until the capsicum has started to soften. Next I've got one small eggplant or aubergine and I've just chopped it into little cubes and two small zucchini which I've just sliced up and just stir our vegetables together and we're just going to cook this for another two minutes until the vegetables start to soften. Next I'm adding in some tomatoes, three tomatoes which I've just chopped up and about a tablespoon of red wine vinegar. I'm not measuring, I'm just splashing it in. This will help to give a real good zest to this. And we're just gonna cook this stirring for about 30 seconds to a minute, just to allow that vinegar to evaporate. Add in a quarter of a cup of water. Season with some salt and some pepper. Give that a good stir. Once this starts simmering, all we need to do is put the lid on and we're just going to allow this to simmer for about five minutes or until the sauce in it has thickened. Five minutes later and whoo, wow, hot. That is looking sensational. All right, I think we're just about ready to serve. Now, for you Faulty Towers enthusiasts out there, I am not going to be adding basil to the ratatouille, but I am going to put a little bit of parsley on the top. Let's have a taste. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. There's a lot of flavours going on there. You've got the tomato and the garlic. You've got a little bit of that red wine vinegar there, but it doesn't have a vinegary taste to it. It just has a sort of a light fruity sort of flavour to it. You've got that beautiful tender eggplant. Absolutely gorgeous. Well, I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Check out my other videos at onepotchefshow.com. And until next time, see you later.